OK, Kevin, a 7-0 win tonight. What did you make of that game? Obviously delighted. Um, we actually challenged the boys at half-time, I think, for the first 15-20 minutes. We were a bit sloppy at times, but we went through a period in the second half where we were breathtaking and you know, fair play to the boys. The one thing we said to them at half-time was, can you keep it going in the second half? Obviously, we made a few changes. It's up to the boys that come on to try and keep that momentum going, keep that quality going, and some of the play tonight was different class. And after the game last week, David had said we're maybe going to work a bit more on the play in and around the penalty box. Do you think that benefited you tonight? Well, obviously, scoring seven goals, obviously, they've, they've certainly took something out of training. We've, we've put a wee bit onus on the boys to try and play through the middle of the pitch a wee bit more. Um, at times, we, we're a wee bit passive in possession. At times, we play down the sides, and you know, we've challenged them to really penetrate through the middle of the pitch. So I thought tonight some of our play was excellent. Um, the front boys were, were really at it. And to be fair to Motherwell, I spoke to Clarkie before the, before the game, David Clarkson, and he really fancied them tonight. They've, I think they've been doing really well. So um, the fact that they are a decent bunch, um, good set of players, and as I say, when the boys were at it, they were they were breathtaking at times. And Chris McKee obviously came into the starting lineup tonight and got his four goals as well. Obviously delighted for Chris, he's a good lad. Um, he's found game time at times difficult. Obviously we've got really good front players, we've got good players in every position, so the boys know when they do get opportunities to get in, they need to try and stay in. And that's the type of thing we want to try and create, that like almost first team level to try and teach the boys that when you're playing well you stay in, when you're not playing well you need to fight for your jersey. So, um, you know, delighted for them. Seven goals, we, you know, I'm always one of the ones that always wants more, quite greedy when it comes to being a coach, so, um, but absolutely delighted for them tonight. Yeah. And they've had a good start to the season as well, do you feel that they're, they're growing every week? I think so, It's um, the, the frustrating thing about being another 18s coach is we want to obviously try and pr produce as many good players for Mertz and Peter to obviously play in the reserves, So and obviously every year we bring in a new batch, so you always feel as though you're, you're getting somewhere by the time you get to Christmas, before, but as you're approaching the end of the season and you're almost starting all over again, um, but the batch we brought in this year has got real quality and um, it's up to us to try and produce as many good players as we possibly can, as I say, for Mertz, and then hopefully they can go into Mertz and Peter's group and, and do really well for them and then try and get them in the first team. That's the, that's the main objective of being a coach at this place.